what is going on fellas welcome back to david great nation so we are back again with another sap fico tutorial video this time we are going to talk about how to automate gl posting without any customization without any enhancement at all so i have already created a video about how to automate gl posting ar posting or ap posting using a bappy so you can go and check that video let me also give you a glimpse of that video so this is the function module standard function module which you can enhance to post the document so bappy scc document post for fico posting you just need to execute it and i have already created a variant so this is my variant and if i execute an fico document will be posted so i'm going to execute and this is the FIC document which will be posted but I'm not going to show you the content of this FM because I have already discussed about it so today I'm going to show you without any enhancement without any help of ABAPAR how can you yourself post multiple document in one shot okay obviously this is going to be only GL to GL posting AR posting or AP posting will not work in this way so for that i am going to open the fury so i'm going back to my home screen and i have put the t code for fury as a favorite just double click on this t code it will open up fury just logging in so my fury is opening up So this is my home page of the Fiori screen. So first I'm going to post a manual entry. Then I'm going to show you how can we post multiple GL document in one shot. So for that go to this journal entry tab. And here you see post general journal entry. This application is similar to FB50. So first I'm going to post you a manual journal entry. So click on this post general journal entries. So here I'm going to uh, select today's date, 25th of March. Uh, company code document type transaction is fine. So for that, let me copy my GL account. So this is my expense GL. So I'm going to book an entry of say $52. And since this is a profit and loss GL, I need a cost object. So I am selecting a cost center and also i am entering a segment fine i am collapsing this node and now my bank gl so this is my bank gl entering the bank gl and here just putting star and now i am going to simulate to see whether this will work or not so click on the simulate button so it says one GL has, it's a warning message, one, one of the GL has tax posting allowed, but I haven't posted any tax. That's fine. Just click on this OK button. So this is my simulated view. I haven't posted yet. So this looks fine. So see the document number is not yet posted. So in SAP Fiori, the document number is termed as channel entry. Now things look good. Now click on this post button. So the journal entry is posted the journal entry number is this okay so here you can see this is the header part if i collapse the header data this is a line item this expense gl account debit and petty cash account credit that's fine now uh, let me see whether i can see this gl is this this entry in the this is the traditional view fb03 view and also let me see this entry in the gui so i'll click on fb03 and this is the document number for the company called 2409 and 2023 is a fiscal year. So this is a $52 entry. Now this is single entry. Now, as I told you, I'm going to post multiple entry in one shot. So for that, go back to Fury. So this feature is available only in Fury. Okay. So hit back button. Again, back button. So again, go to journal entries. Now here you see an application called upload general journal entries. Okay. So select this and you see you have to prepare a file and based on that file, multiple journal entries can be posted. Okay. Now, how do I get the file? Just click on this download template 
and with spreadsheet I'm going to download it so this is the template it has been downloaded let's open it now the template has been downloaded now I need to enter the inputs so in my case my company code is 2409 oops first I will enable editing now my company code is 2409 my journal entry type is that is the document type which is SA journal entry days today's date I am going to select say 3 25 2023 same in the posting date so just look for this asterisk this asterisk means that the fields are mandatory so next asterisk is transaction currency mandatory field is transaction currency entered USD do I see any other mandatory field in the header no I don't see any now header is completed now let's go to the line item so generally I get two line items but if I want to add more I can do so so uh, let me add a new line item as well so insert click on this insert button now say this is my this is my requirement okay so the three GL I enter here oops sorry I entered on the company code field actually so this is my now my line item company code is 2409 2409 and 2409 item text I can add any text say here repairs here say maintenance here debit amount say $60 again this one I also want to debit two expenses are debited and one petty cash will be created say here say 35 and here on the credit side 95 the summation of the debits I am putting here on the credit side okay next go to the right tax code I am not using for the time being cost center I would need so I will enter the same cost center let me see what was my cost center yeah this is my cost center so you will not get an F4 button here okay so enter the cost center so these are the two profit and loss GL so here you would need the cost objects next profit center will automatically derive uh, next I would need segment so look for segment so this is a segment which segment did I use last time this one for this one let me use a separate segment say thousand underscore B okay and the third line is the cash GL which does not require any CEO account assignment because it's a balance sheet GL okay similarly I want to post one more document so just copy the header say I am using the same header under the same company code and all okay and here I'm going to use a two-liner okay say this two line item here say I'll call it uh, $40 and $40 okay this would also require a cost center and a segment as well okay so the template comes with two journal entries but similarly you can create multiple journal entries for example if I copy this thing or let me copy from the row so I will copy this rows and here I can paste okay so here as well I can post another journal entry so I'll call it number three and here I'm going to use this other uh, expense GL account so say this one okay and I'll call it repairs and this time say $50 and $50 and say this one I would like to use segment B okay simple so my template is ready so I have created I'm going to upload three journal entries so similarly you can create multiple journal entries you just need to do copy and paste okay so you fill the template copy paste and replace your GL account or company code or you know amounts with different different information okay so let me save it save as say under the download I'll call it 2409 
अंडर स्कोर जे ई अंडर स्कोर ओके सो सेव्ड सो माई अपलोड टेम्पलेट इज रेडी आई गो बैक टू फ्योरी एंड हियर आई एम गोइंग टू लुक फॉर आई आई क्लिक ऑन ब्राउज एंड माई जर्नल एंट्री इज दिस वन ओके सो आई सी जर्नल एंट्रीज हैव बीन अपलोडेड पॉसिबली विथ एरर्स आई सी थ्री लाइन आइटम्स इट हैज पिकड अप द सिस्टम हैज रेड द टेम्पलेट एंड इट हैज फाउंड दैट देर आर थ्री लाइन आइटम्स सो लेट सी इफ देर इज एनी एरर इट डज नॉट से दैट देर इज एरर इट्स एज पॉसिबली विथ एरर सो यू कैन क्लिक ऑन शो लॉक फ्रॉम हियर और यू कैन क्लिक ऑन शो लॉक फ्रॉम हियर ओके सो लेट मी क्लिक ऑन शो लॉक फ्रॉम द टॉप इट विल टेल मी वॉट आर द एरर सो दैट आई कैन रेक्टिफाई सो इट्स एज देर आर सेवन आइटम्स बट आई सी वार्निंग इफ आई गेट इन साइड डू आई सी एनी एरर नो एवरी वेयर आई सी वार्निंग 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 सक्सेस इन्फॉर्मेशन सो दिस इज फाइन सो इट्स एज द डॉक्यूमेंट डेट इज इन फ्यूचर ब्ला 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 दैट्स नॉट अ प्रॉब्लम नाउ सिंस इन दिस सिस्टम द डेट इज वन डे बिहाइंड सो इट इज ट्वेंटी फिफ्थ बट इन दिस सिस्टम इट शोज एज ट्वेंटी फोर्थ सो दैट्स फाइन आल गो बैक so if you want to post this general entry select the line item and click on post or if you want to post all three together so select all because my purpose is to upload multiple line items in one shot so select all line items and click on this post button so there are some warning ignore and post three of three general entries have been posted so there you go you see three general entries are posted if i click on the first entry click on this manage journal entries this is the compound journal entry where i have two debit items and one credit item so this is the one 60 debit 35 debit and 95 credit this is the one you can see this entry in t account view as well so click on this t account view and it will represent like a ledger so there are three gl account involved so here you see the petty cash account is created for 95 dollar and Uh, there is zero balance account i'll talk about zero balance account later and you see there are two profit and loss account one donation account which is 35 debit and one furniture expense furniture account which is debit okay now let's go back if you want to see the inside of it you can click on this button and you will see all the details okay so this is the debit entry so this is my item tax that i entered repairs similarly click on go back to journal entries and click on back button because i have posted three documents so the second entry and similarly the third entry all of them are posted okay now if i want to see the entries that are posted so the entries are 1 all 0 13 to all all 1 all 0 15 so i'll go back to fb5 fb03 and go to document list here i'll enter the range so this is 13 to 15 okay fiscal year 2023 on documents only click on f8 the three documents are posted this is the first one with the compound one and similarly this is the second one and this is the third one okay and so see here from here you can see the gl view so this is your entry view if you click on the gl view you can see the zero balance clearing account so in gy you can see similarly in fury if you want to see the gl view as well so how do you see that you go back to the manage journal entry screen here let me go back to the compound journal where i can see the zero balances so this is the first one the compound journal just go to manage journal entries and from this drop down select ledger view that is a gl view and you can see all the zero balance clearing entries here so there you go use this app upload general journal entries to post multiple journal entries without any enhancement at all but it can be used for gl posting only not for ar or ap posting if you still want to post multiple ar and ap entries then you have to enhance you have to take the use of this uh fm that i have already discussed but for fb50 you can very well use this channel entry thanks again for your love and support we'll come back again with another important tutorial video